Hi everyone and welcome back to a new Spring Boot Security episode. Today we are going to talk about the difference between authentication and authorization. And I want to talk about this because, uh, especially for beginners, these terms can be a little bit confusing. Before we begin, I would also like to remind you to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel in order to stay tuned for more software development courses that will sharpen your programming skills. Now, authentication is pretty simple. Now, authentication is all about who you are in the context of an application. So. You are a user inside an application. You are, think about your email address. Um, for example, you are John Doe uh, in the context of, uh, I don't know, Gmail or Yahoo application. Now, authorization on the other hand is about what you are allowed to do in the context of an application. So for example, if you take the email analogy, uh, after you sign in your email app, you are allowed to send mails, to read emails, to put tags on them, and so on and so forth. Uh, let's illustrate this with an example. Let's take Sally, and Sally is a user for you know an online sales app. Now, Sally works in the sales department. So, the first thing she does when she arrives to work is she wants to sign in uh, the sales app. So, Sally signs in with her credentials, and if those credentials are correct, we say that Sally is authenticated. Now, Sally also has some rights inside the sales app. So, for example, Sally is allowed to view the sales section and, uh, you know, use all the features that are related somehow to her job, to sales. On the other hand, Sally is not allowed to access the admin section and she's not allowed to access the user section. Now, in this context, we say that Sally is authenticated and she's authorized to access the sales features. Now, in terms of uh, how exactly are these things implemented? Well, if you talk about authentication, authentication can be implemented in multiple ways. So we can have HTTP authentication, we can have forms authentication, which is the most common, it's you know, when you type in your username and password in a login form, we can have, you know, authentication based on a certificate uh, or we can use tokens for the authentication. So each, uh, the method is not important, but the outcome is the same. Authentication identifies you as somebody in, you know, an app. Authorization, on the other hand, is all about, you know, uh, privileges or authorities and about roles. So based on your privileges or based on the role you have inside an app, you are allowed or not allowed to do certain things. Before we close, I would like to remind you to subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for more software development tutorials that will sharpen your programming skills. Just go to the Romanian Coder YouTube page and click on the subscribe button. Also, if you found this video useful, please hit the like button and share it with your friends. If you have any comments, thoughts or ideas for new courses, just put them in the comment section at the end of this video because I would love to get feedback from you guys. You can also find me on Twitter at RomanianCoder and you can also check out my blog www.romaniancoder.com. Until next time, have a great day and write amazing code. Goodbye.